I really don't know what to say. Good morning. Today we are going to Konya. <laughs> This place is called Chata Hoyuk, close to Konya in Turkey. And this is supposed to be the oldest discovered village in the world. That's crazy. The most stunning feature about this village is they are entering their houses from the top. That does not make sense for me. Why? It's Saturday evening here in Konya and that means one thing, dancing dervishes. And a dervish is somebody from Sufism that practices this meditational art form of dancing. I don't know anything about it, but now I'm gonna go into this show, see it for myself. I'm pretty excited, I'm looking forward to this. This is the reason why I came back to Konya. <laughs> The show has just ended. You see everybody is already leaving. It was very impressive. But now I have even more questions than before. <laughs> They're already turning off the lights. So now after the show, I have the feeling that I'm lost. I have the feeling that I don't know anything about life anymore. I have so much more questions now. There was some really strange energy in this room. But what is it, all of this? I feel lost at the moment. I really don't know what to say. Good morning. I'm still in my head with this dervish show from yesterday. I'm still thinking about it because it gave me so much new questions. This show didn't answer any of my questions, it just made more of it. That's why I now came to the Mevlan Museum. Here the dervishes were living and were trained to become a dervish. The only sad thing is the iconic blue tower of this museum is under renovation. I took this audio guide to have a real understanding from what is going on here. Because there is not a lot of English information. I just finished with the tour with the audiobook and now I learned so much that I don't know where to start anymore to tell the story. 
but the story is all about Rumi, how he came here and with his, with his caravan and became a very influential and important person to, to Sufism. It's not so easy to explain. Let me quickly try to explain who Rumi is, because this story is all about Rumi. So Rumi was born in Belka and he got a It's a beautiful story. I hope I made some sense out of the story because it's a big story and it's a bit complicated, but I hope you have now sort of an idea who Rumi is. Thanks for watching my rolling dervis video. I know it's not the usual content that I normally make, but I was just so into these rolling dervishes and I wanted to discover what it actually means and is a rolling dervish. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. But for now, I hope you'll always see the lion stars. Follow your dreams and until next time you do. Ciao! I saw this abandoned building next to the road. It looks pretty epic, so I quickly parked my car and I'm gonna have a look because I love abandoned buildings. I love to see how nature is taking back what is actually already from nature. I think it was like a party place. There's even a stairway to go underground. That's nice and creepy, let's do it. Okay, that was cool. Whoa, there was security, keep on walking. Keep on walking. I hope he's not following me. I'm always at the car.